U.S. has seen more than 70,000 coronavirus cases a day, and the holidays are quickly approaching. Uh, Fox's Jayla Whitfield is in Washington, D.C. tonight with details on that. Jayla? That's exactly right. Halloween is just six days away, and families nationwide are planning to celebrate. Last year, Halloween activities were put on pause as the coronavirus pandemic reached its peak. But this year, the CDC says it's safe for children to go trick-or-treating. They say children and their families still need to be safe and be careful to avoid getting the coronavirus. And they recommend staying outdoors would be best. The CDC director says if children are spread out while trick-or-treating, they should be safe. It's critically important that we gather, that we be together with our family and friends during these holidays, and we have the prevention strategies that we know work to be safe for those holidays. So what I would say is get yourself vaccinated before you gather. It will absolutely be safer if you're vaccinated. Any activity that is outdoors is safer than it is if it's indoors. And if you're gathering multiple households, make sure as many people are vaccinated as possible um, so you can pre protect the people who are vulnerable, who might not yet be vaccinated, our young children, our elderly. The Pfizer vaccine is available for people ages 12 and older, and the company recently requested that the FDA authorize shots for kids ages 5 to 11. Even though the spread of the Delta variant is slowing down, Waleski says the coronavirus is still here and getting vaccinated is the key. Looking forward, the CDC says that vaccinated Americans should also be able to enjoy Thanksgiving and Christmas this year, too. In Washington, Jayla Whitfield, Fox 5 news.